Welcome from Munich, we have a brand new Samsung Galaxy tablet here, which is called the Tab A. Again, a new um, name for a new tablet. Tab S was a premium device last year. Now we have a little bit of cheaper um, devices this year with the Tab A. Here we have the 9.7 inch version with LTE 4G built in. It's also available as a Wi Fi only version, but this one has 2 gigs of RAM, otherwise, we would have 1.5 gigs. 1.2 GHz um, quad core processor is inside here. The box, you can see it here. It's quite light and there's not too many technical specs here on the box, but you can read some of them here. Like, for example, like the display resolution is also not too high with only 10 and 24 times 768. That's what XGA stands for. And otherwise, um, it's available in black and white. Here we have the black version with the 5 megapixel camera on the back and the 2 megapixel camera on the front, which is also called the T555. So again, this is the 4G LTE version here for Germany in sandy black. So let me open it up and let's see what's inside the box and how it feels like um, after we have already taken a look in Taiwan at um, the device in a store where um, it's making a big fuss there with the 8 inch and the 9.7 inch device, especially the 8 inch with the stylus could be interesting, but both have the same low resolution display. So I'm not sure if that will be a good match for the price of 329 um, for the 4G version and also 269 for the Wi-Fi version. So I think at least both prices should go down 50 euros or 50 US dollars to make it interesting. So you have here the tablet itself, 9.7 inch. We'll take a closer look at that in a second. Let me put this to the side, open up here the white um, box and let's see, we don't have too much in here as I can see already. Uh, only a quick start guard, not too thick. So just I think how to turn it on and what to do for the first steps. One USB charger, two amps, five volts, so about Three hours for the 6000 milliamp battery is the time that you have to charge this device and also micro USB cable again not too long just a standard six foot um, here for the tablet so um, yeah for data transfer for the 16 or 32 gigs that you can find inside and also it's expandable via micro SD so that's also not too much of a surprise. So here the tablet itself with a button here on the front where you can just turn it on. As you will see here we have Lollipop running 5.0 and then we have the last app button at the back button here on the bottom. On the top there is nothing except for a little sticker which says Qualcomm 4G. So there's a Qualcomm processor inside. We have the on and off switch here, volume rocker on this side, a micro SD card slot and also the SIM card um, slot um, here on the side. So. No surprises there. On the bottom you will find your micro USB charger, headset port and also the two speakers and nothing on the other side here on the Samsung Galaxy Tab A. On the back you can see the 5 megapixel camera with no flash, a Samsung logo which is barely visible and also a, a sticker and otherwise the places here we could um, add actually the extra little covers and everything else that Samsung has to offer but that's not that interesting um, because those are again quite expensive and I don't think that most people will buy it um, for this brand new Samsung Galaxy Tab A. 100 gig of free, one drive storage, so again not, no Google Drive storage here. Uh, OneDrive, the new partner with Samsung because we have all the Microsoft apps already pre-installed like um, Office, um, apps, PowerPoint, OneNote, Skype, OneDrive, World and Excel, but still all the Google apps are also here. And um, otherwise, this is the whole list of apps that you have already on here. Of course, some German apps like Zalando and Kaufta are also here because this is from Germany, but otherwise the standard camera apps, my Samsung, and also here the uh, Flipboard is already on the Samsung Galaxy Tab A. But I can also just open up the camera really quick to show you guys here the back camera, which could have a little bit better quality, but of course we are in low light situation right now, so it's all right. Um, 720p is the video that you can record um, at high, at the highest uh, settings and then here the front camera um, also here with my Sony camera in the front. You can see that happening there. 2 megapixel also here 720p for video recording. Full review with a few games, um, Office, a keyboard and everything else coming up in my video. Next thing much tuning in, this was the Samsung Galaxy Tab A in a short unboxing and maybe even comparison with an Apple iPad 3, but more with that in my next video with a full review. Thank much for tuning in and don't forget to subscribe.